Hey, what's up guys? This is Ben with Fat House Fab, and we're here today to talk about our new Motec M150 engine management system. Sitting behind me is one of our Shelby GT350 1000R packages. This car has our custom twin turbo kit, full stainless steel headers, zona rotor turbos, uh, ID injectors, it's got a full fuel system in it, um, full custom exhaust. You can read about that on our website, and we're also going to do another video on that later. Uh, but I want to go over the Motec M150 system with you right now. This completely replaces the factory Ford system with a much more advanced engine management system that allows all kinds of cool features, which I'm going to go over with you right now. Uh, we get advanced traction control, fully adjustable. We've got nine different levels of traction control, so you can change that based on how comfortable you are with the car. We've got roll and anti-lag, which is going to allow you to build boost from a roll and launch the car hard from any speed or RPM you desire. We've got boost by gear, so we can limit the boost down low to help get the car better traction while you're driving. Uh, we've got ghost cam mode. Uh, we repurpose all of the drive modes so that now they are selectable for how much power the car makes. So as you go through the different modes, uh, it's going to add boost, going to add timing, going to get more power, more throttle aggressiveness. Um, we've got aggressive launch control, so it works just like factory through the controls, but it's going to build boost. It's going to shoot fire out the exhaust. <laughs> um, we've got engine fail-safe features. So, you know, low oil pressure, coolant temp gets too high, the car's gonna throw a check engine light for you. Now, the car is also true flex fuel now, so it has an ethanol content sensor on board, and we repurpose the oil pressure gauge to show ethanol content upon startup. So you start the car, it's gonna show you what your ethanol content is, then it's gonna go right back to reading uh, oil pressure, so it just operates like normal. Um, so now we're gonna do is we're gonna go take a test drive in this car and show you how some of these features work. So we're just out for a test drive in this 1000R twin turbo package car. Uh, this car is a 2017 GT350. Uh, this car makes about 950 horsepower to the wheels on an E85. This is a full flex fuel capable system. Uh, basically that means you can run any mixture of 93 octane uh, pump gas to E85 and the Motec will detect the ethanol percentage and adjust power, timing, everything on the fly. There's no need to change tunes. There's no need to drain your tank. Uh, very high-tech system just works just like a factory flex fuel system You'll be able to put the fuel in Any ratio between 0 to 100 percent E85 uh, Your factory oil pressure gauge is going to display ethanol content upon startup It's going to show you that percentage for about five seconds and then it's going to return to its normal uh, oil pressure reading uh, One thing I love about these cars is how easy they are to drive. They, I mean it literally drives just like stock um, except it obviously has a lot more power, which these cars do need from the factory. It's a great handling setup. Um, great package put together by Ford. Just lacks a little bit in the power department, especially for streetcar guys that aren't really road racing these heavily. Uh, more power is definitely needed. So with the 1000 R kit, we're able to deliver that. Um, this car ranges from about 700 horsepower to the tires on 93 octane and some of the base settings all the way up to 950 horsepower to the tires. Uh, and with the Motec system, we have full traction control integrated into the car. It's adjustable. You can go through the map modes by pressing the uh, cancel, cruise control cancel button, and that's gonna display the map you're currently in. So let's say the tack will go to one, and then you can toggle up and down with the cruise control button to go to the more aggressive traction control maps. On setting one, it's basically not gonna let the car spin at all. Uh, setting two, three, four, as you go up, it's going to get more aggressive. It's going to allow for more tire slips. So as you get used to how your car drives, feel more comfortable with the power, you can turn that trash control map up uh, to gain a little bit more uh, power planning to the ground uh, when you know, spin, drive the car a little bit more. Uh, some of the other things that we have with this is the drive modes are fully functional. So as you're driving the car, you decide you want to turn the power up. You can go into the drive modes. You've got normal, uh, sport, weather, uh, track and drag mode. So drag mode is going to be your most aggressive settings. You're going to be able to go to that mode through the steering uh, steering wheel buttons. Uh, when you get in drag mode, that's going to be the most aggressive traction control strategy, the most aggressive launch control, the most aggressive roll and anti-lag, uh, as well as um, the highest power setting in the system with ghost cam mode as well. So we went over ghost cam earlier and the ghost cam mode is activated just by going to drag mode. You can turn that on and off on the fly. So that's a really cool feature to be able to just drive around with the ghost cam, turn it off on the steering wheel when you get tired of it or don't want to, don't want to be loud.
now. You know, I've got the AC on. Uh, I can listen to the radio. Just cruise around, do whatever, whatever I want, just like a stock car would. Um, don't notice anything weird about the car. Nothing, you know, sounds funny. Nothing uh, drives weird at all. It drives just like a stock car would, just with more power, a lot better sound. Uh, the turbo system has a great sound on it. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drive down here. We're gonna get to uh, get to a good, safe spot to demonstrate some of these features. And I'm gonna show you how the rolling anti-lag and how the traction control actually functions. Now the way this rolling anti-lag works is we're gonna get into the mile per hour and RPM and the gear desired. We're gonna press and hold the cruise set minus button and floor the gas. When we do that, it's gonna maintain the RPM we're at and the speed we're at, and it's gonna build boost. As soon as we let go of the cruise set minus button, the car is gonna launch hard and full power will be delivered. Trash control will kick in and uh, modulate that to give you best power uh, to the ground ratio possible. switch over to drag mode here real quick, get some cam action. Alright guys, that concludes our Motec M150 demo video. Uh, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel uh, for more badass content. As we turbo the world, we're going to have a lot of cool stuff coming out. Also, check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Fat House Fab, and we'll see you next time.